Brutal Battle Beer Break, and today we're going to be doing actually a style I've not done on Brutal Battle Beer Break, and I've had maybe one on the podcast itself, but not a whole lot. It is a Scotch Ale, and it is a Scotch Ale called Big Sound, and it's by Cigar City Brewing out of Tampa, Florida. You can see, Big Sound. And I actually looked, and there's no information on ABV for this beer, so I'm wondering if it'll taste astringent or not. Um, we'll have to see what happens here, because while I was setting up to record, I actually knocked the bottle over, so I'm hoping that when I open this up, it's not going to have a, an issue. But we'll see. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> Safe. Alright, let's pour a little bit of this bad boy. Oh yeah, what I expected, like a reddish brown hue to this beer. Um, I mean, that's what I expect from like a Scotch Ale, is, is like a red aspect to it. Um, but this is a nice reddish brown. There's an okay amount of head for what you would assume is more of a viscous style beer. Um, can't really see through just because of how dark it is. It's filtered though. But, you know, you can't see much. It just looks dark. Mm. It's got this nice sweet, sweet aspect to it. Some nice kind of cherry notes on the nose, what I'm getting first. Um, slight bit of a raisininess, but uh, actually a lot more cherry. A little bit of a roasty maltiness. A little bit of a, there's a little bit of a grassiness in there as well. Like there's some solid uh, hopping added to this. It smells very clean, though. You know, there, there are no aromas that, that make a smell, like, funky or weird, or it just smells like such a clean, straightforward scotch ale. Whew. I'm smelling a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of that cherry. And it's like fresh cherries. It's not like canned cherries or maraschino or anything like that. It's like legitimate, from-the-garden, fresh cherries. Not tart, maybe like Bing cherries, something like that. But there's a nice sweetness really rounding it out. It smells really good. I'm going to try this. Yeah. Wow. Okay. It's um, it's not as viscous as I thought it would be, but it's also not like extremely light. So it's kind of like a medium, medium body to it. I was expecting maybe of like a medium heavy body to it. Um, something like that, but um, I get a lot of that kind of uh, raisiny aspect. I get that those cherry notes as well. Really got to dissect this. Lots of cherry, actually. I'm getting a little bit of that grassiness coming through as well. Um, what's sticking around is that kind of cherry aspect mainly. Um, a little bit of alcohol to it, not anything too crazy. But as far as scotch ales go, I feel like a lot of scotch ales have a tendency to get kind of sweet, kind of alcohol-y. Um, this is neither of those. This is dialing back the sweet, dialing back the alcohol. Uh, it's got a nice, like, legitimate kind of cherry flavor to it. Um, the malts are very nice in it, and like I said, a little bit of, like, a grassy aspect to it. Not a ton, but a little bit. Nice beer. Um... Easy drinking as far as scotch ales go. Uh, a lot of scotch ales I've had before don't seem as easy drinking as this. But actually, as I'm sitting here, I'm noticing I'm feeling a little bit of like an alcohol burn in my throat at the moment. And it's funny because it wasn't there at all. And then all of a sudden, as I've been talking, it's just slowly started kind of building and building and building. Not a bad thing at all, but um, it lets me know there's some serious alcohol in it. I don't taste it, but I can feel it after. So, nicely crafted beer. Um, Cigar City, a lot of people love Cigar City and expect nicely crafted beers. So, this Scotch Ale Big Sound is no different than what people expect from Cigar City. Thanks so much, Cigar City, for making this beer. Uh, if anyone out there can get their hands on it, I would recommend it. So, go ahead and find it if you can. I actually got this from the brew pub when uh, my wife and I were down there uh, recently. So, um, I know it's there, so if you live in that area. If not, sorry, you might not be able to find it. But anyway, thanks so much for checking this out, everybody. 
feel inspired. I like this beer. I'm going to continue to sip on it. So why don't you go and get yourself an awesome beer and enjoy. Thanks for checking it out.